Now, I salute them. They are real hip-hop. But when the picture comes out and you're wearing a dress two days later, like, bro, we got this all fucked up now. Where's the backpack? Where's the Tim's? Where's the, the where, where, like, like, where's the Brooklyn in the house? What's up, everybody? This is the world-famous Ed Lover, and you are watching Forgotten Kings TV. That's right. Forgotten Kings TV. Come on, son. Let's go straight into most deaf. Now, I'm older now. If I was younger, I would have responded a whole different way. Most deaf, you know, what's real hip hop? Who's real hip hop? You know, I'm digging in the crates. I'm Flojo with the army jacket. I'm down with Diamond D, Big L, Lord Finesse, Showbiz AG, Buck Wild, OC. I came up with Buckshot Jordy. I came up with every boom back. Hip hop, you could think. Evil D, the gang star, Guru's my man, recipe. Like, so I come from the cloth of real hip hop. Born in the Bronx. And so when you, so when you think about this, I'm born in the Bronx in the inception of hip hop, just being a fan, right? Seen it all. So most definitely, I understood what he tried to say. Yo, Drake ain't hip hop. They play him in the stores. After he said that, I ain't gonna lie. Every store I went into, I used to tell Rich the Barber, yo, Rich, he ain't lying. They play the nigga shit in the elevator everywhere. Cool. But what? what's the name of the Drake songs? The, the Six in the Morning and... No, I'm talking about what? 6 a.m. 6 a.m.? He spits... Yo, look, Drake makes hits for everybody. Yes, he's a pop star. He is a pop star, right? And he makes hits for everybody. But we can't count him out and say he's not hip-hop. And the scary thing about me, y'all already Clay, the scary thing about me doing a show like this is be careful what you wish for while throwing stones while living in a glass house. So now, most Def is the pure of hip hop. I guess, right? He's down with Dave Chappelle. He's down with, shout out to Dave Chappelle sending me the sneaker. Talib Kweli, this. They the pure, I guess. They assume they're the pure, right? Now I salute them. They are real hip hop. But when the picture comes out and you're wearing a dress two days later, like, bro, we got this all fucked up now. Where's the backpack? Where's the Tim's? Where's the, the where, where, like, like, where's the Brooklyn in the house? You know, this is the time, of, this is the time when Brooklyn don't claim certain dudes. Like, at a time like this, they'll shy away from them and be like, nah, 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 nah. That ain't, that ain't Atlantic Avenue, bro. That ain't bed -Stuy. That's, yo, bro. <clears throat> the boy got the moon boots on. The shit's my daughter wear with a kilt. That I don't give a f you call it a kill, call it a skirt. It's a skirt. It's a skirt. I'm on my live. I'm on. Can you call Lorena and tell her I'm on my live? Text her and tell her I'm on my live. It is what it is. And so we can't. We can't. And I've seen a lot of people. I see Knicks Fan TV on here. I seen a lot of people come, they beat me to this. They just ran to it, like Waka Flocka, Five Mics, this, every, you can't do that. You can't disvalidate somebody because you're the pure hip hop and the next day it's this picture of you with a skirt on with moon boots. Come on. That one threw me for a loop, cause I, cause I, I, I was still gonna defend Drake and say, yo, he's hip hop, he spits better than everybody, he just makes hits for everybody. But I was gonna go most deaf. I understand we come from the same roots, the same tree. But a day later, the skirt, the the kilt, credibility's at an all time low. <laughs> Yeah.
Uh, we the Knockout Kings of Comedy. This your boy, Reggie Curl, you know what I'm saying? This is my cousin, Troncho, you know what I'm saying? He's coming by. You know, I know me old. He's fucking with lambskin condoms. <laughs> from Aldi's. The f*** wrong with you? Aldi's, you should eat this. We don't know what the f*** that meat is. No! For real, I heard a nigga get in prison. That's not the f*** the part about it. The part about it is he had the audacity to ask me why I ain't helping my s***. It ain't no point of both of us get I step up, look him right in his eyes. <laughs> he go to pat me down. Bop, 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 bop. Twenty dollars, homeboy. I'm like, <laughs> no sir. First of all, can I ask y'all a personal question? Is this microphone really necessary? At this Punchline, punchline, punchline. You know how to turn. Give me a second.